Hey guys, it's Kenzie here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to have the best lazy day ever. So first, I'm going to be showing you, like, what part you can have your best lazy day ever, I guess, in, and, yeah. So I'm not trying to be, first off, I'm not trying to be rude to anybody that has, like, their own lazy days, like, you can have whatever you call a lazy day. My lazy day is usually laying in my bed and watching YouTube all day. But I'm just showing you if you really want to have like the best um, lazy day sleep. Uh, why am I saying sleepover? The best lazy day ever, then keep watching this video. So yeah, so first I'm going to be talking about where you can have your best lazy day ever. So the you can make your own like comfy spot. So what I do for a comfy spot is I just like lay in my bed and surround myself with like blankets and pal and pillows. But what you can do is you can make a fort or you can like um lay like a really soft um blanket on the floor and then put like pillows around there and just make your own little fort or do whatever. Um I don't know, like stay wherever you think is the most comfiest spot. I don't know. The next thing that you can do, well, that's this part. Now I'm going to be talking about things that you can do to, like, make it the best lazy day ever. Is you can make sure that all your electronics, like your phone, tablet, computer, like, all that stuff is charged. So you can either, like, watch YouTube all day, play games all day, like, do whatever you want on your electronic devices all day. Or you can, like, watch Netflix all day or watch TV all day. That's always fun. So the next thing you can do is you can let me see here yes make sure you like have snacks by you and stuff so you don't have to like get up go all the way downstairs to your fridge or you just don't have to get up here to go get food so just make sure you have like your lunch by you or like some snacks like for instance pickle chips <laughs> i love pickle chips but just have like snacks around you so you don't have to like get up and go get them yourself um, the next thing you can do is to wear fuzzy socks, because who doesn't love fuzzy socks on a lazy day? That's just, like, the best. Now I'm going to be talking about what you should wear and, like, um, how you can have your hair, makeup, and outfit for a lazy day. So, for your outfit, I suggest wearing sweatpants and a comfy t-shirt or a comfy sweatshirt or something like that. Or if you wake up in the morning and you're just wearing your pajamas and you just want to stay in your pajamas... It's fine with that too. Half the time I just stay in my pajamas. So, um, then th what you can do for hair is you can, if you want to do anything with your hair, you can either leave it at, at uh, you can either, yeah, I can't talk today. You can either leave it as it is, um, just brush it out and just wear it down, or you can just wear a messy bun because messy done, uh, messy buns are like for lazy days. They're like meant for lazy days okay um and then for makeup i suggest not wearing makeup at all because like you're kind of putting effort in your face but it's supposed to be a lazy day but if you want to wear makeup that's fine like if you want it to be like more dressy or lazy day like if you're just going to the grocery store or something i don't know but if you want to do makeup i suggest wearing like just a very light makeup what i would do for makeup is just wearing foundation a little bit of blush. I wouldn't wear mascara. I would just, because then you have to, like, take it all off and everything. I would just, like, curl my eyelashes. And then I would wear just a teensy tiny bit of, hang on a second. Sorry. I would wear just a teensy tiny bit of bronzer if you want to, just, like, up here and right there and just wherever you want. And then I would wear a lip balm because you don't really need lipstick on a lazy day if you're not, like, going in real fancy. But... I, I always just wear a lip balm anyway, so, um, and then, yeah, and then if you want to have, like, an epic, epic lazy day, you can invite a friend over if you want, and then you, too, can have the best lazy day ever. So those are things you can do to have the best lazy day ever. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up, and, yeah, so, um, Hang on a second. Okay, now I'm going to be talking about some of the seasons or like playlists that I'm going to be doing this summer. So what am I going to, what I'm going to be doing this summer is I'm going to be doing this series slash playlist 
of 10 reasons and what it, what I'm calling it 10 reasons and what I'm going to be doing is like 10 reasons why you should be healthy during the summer like 10 reasons 10 reasons why you shouldn't wear, wear makeup just like 10 reasons why you shouldn't do stuff or like why you should do stuff or something like that and I'm going to be it's kind of like a talking with me video and I'm going to be doing that every now and then during the summer it's not going to be like a giant list like all in a row is gonna I'm gonna make five videos and it's gonna be every now and then so like every three videos I would make one or like every few weeks something like that and then the next playlist I'm gonna be doing which I've already kind of been doing it is I'm gonna be doing um this series slash playlist which is pretty much just gonna go on forever uh called gas station adventures and I figured, why don't I do this? Because I always make gas station adventure vlog things. So I'm going to be making this every once in a while. I'm going to be making a gas station adventure video um, every, like, every other month or every few weeks. Not, like, every other week. Just, like, every once in a while. And it's where I go to the gas station either by myself, which I don't think I would ever do because that would be kind of boring, honestly. Um... It's where I go to the gas station with one of my friends, and we just, you just get to just come on a gas station adventure, and we just get to, I just get to talk to you guys and tell you, like, all the upcoming things and just a bunch of stuff like that. So that's what we're going to, that's what I'm going to be doing this year and probably the next year that I'm doing YouTube. And then the exciting thing that I'm going to be doing this August is this series called Parent vs. Child. And here. I'm going to be doing this series called Parent vs. Child. And what it is, is I'm going to be downloading this little, like, I think it's called a like, trivia app or something. And then I'm going to be taking, um, it's going to be me and either my parent or, like, some other grown-up. And we're going to be answering questions on the app trivia and whoever gets them right gets a point or something there'll be like five questions on each video and then in the end this is during like the beginning of this career and then during the end of like um september or like the beginning of the august we will add like all the points up and then we can see who's the smartest so that's what i'm going to be doing it that's what i'm going to be doing this august through the beginning of october for like the school year kind of but again it wouldn't be like just in one row it would be like every other way or every two videos like I think I'll do like one time a week or something but yeah that's what I'm going to be doing this summer so anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more so yeah bye